How do you feel about butt stuff? Butt stuff. Hmm. I think, I think. How do I feel about butt stuff? I mean, if you like it, get to it. I haven't personally had any butt stuff in mind, so I can't talk about that, but other people seem to like playing in their butts, so good on you if you like it. Yeah, I just, I'm really scared of like getting like a prolapsed asshole, so I just really haven't done it. I just, I've seen videos of like girls who have like taken it too far and it just, I'm fine with like, you know, teasing, but like, yeah, not the full thing. Butt stuff? No, just keep that away from me. No, I'm, I'm not really into it, you know. It's definitely, it's more, it's probably a turnoff more than anything for my, for myself, you know what I mean? But, you know, to each his own for people out there just enjoying the booty stuff. I don't like it. Don't get anywhere near it. Nope. Ah, uh, if you keep your butt clean, butt stuff is great. There have definitely been times where, like, I've, you know, tried to get into butt stuff with, like, partners, and there, some people just have terrible hygiene, um, which makes it impossible. Um, I'm very small. I think stimulation around that area is good. Like rimming, maybe like a little bit of penetration, but full penetration? I don't know. I don't know if I've necessarily trusted any of my partners to not just like destroy me. How do you feel about butt stuff? What do you mean butt stuff? Like do I want to go fuck a girl in the ass if she has a nice ass? Hey, I'd fuck the chick in the ass for sure, yeah. Stay away from my ass. That's for damn sure. I will start shitting on your face. Trying to get close to me back there. What the fuck's wrong with you? So the taint's okay, but the The taint is just, just like, look, like the, the, that little, that, the little piece of space in between, that's Switzerland. Okay? Once you cross Switzerland, mm-mm, got problems. Go to war. Depends on the person. Um, yeah. To an extent, butt stuff's good. I don't thoroughly enjoy a penis in my ass, but a little finger action's fine while fucking me. For three seconds, I think it was tried, but I couldn't imagine going, going for longer because I felt it the next day too, and it was just three seconds. I personally don't feel comfortable, um, but I'm not opposed to anyone else who does. Like, if I was with a guy and he wanted it done to him, like, I'd be open to trying it. But, like, for me, I just don't like that. Like, I have a vagina. That's what it's for. You don't need to do that to my butt. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm someone else. Yeah, yeah, just go crazy. Yeah, just, just not my ass, though. Yeah. How do you feel about butt stuff? I'm gay. I live for butt stuff. That's pretty much the definition of my life. Adam, butt stuff. Uh, I think it's fun, but you should definitely ask your partner first and not try to be like, oh, that's the wrong hole or something. It can be like a really good and enjoyable time, but you need to see if it's for you. I had a boyfriend at one point that really wanted to try it. Um, I didn't want to, so we didn't, and we're not together. This is a great disclaimer for anyone who's interested in that. I am not for you, but there's someone out there. How would you feel about doing it to someone else? Mm, no. Not the biggest fan. Had a bad experience with it. Share that experience I, I can. It wasn't, oh, so here's the thing. It's accidental anal, which is not, don't do it. If you're gonna do anal, prepare, get that stuff ready, uh-uh. My, my boyfriend, I was bent over the bed, so he's hitting me from behind. I like came, and so it got like super wet. He slipped out, went into my ass, and came out. That was the worst pain I think I've, um, almost one of the worst pains I've ever felt. And I said, ow, he said, ow. I immediately left the room, went into the bathroom and just like blood was just like everywhere. And I was in a lot of pain. He was in a lot of pain. And I kind of just walked back in and I was like, I, I, I'm bleeding. Like, should I be concerned? And he's like, and I was like, do I need to go to the hospital? Like, I was so confused. And he was like, no, no, you're okay. And so I was like, all right, all right. And then I went shopping later and I was at like a thrift store. So they're, their bathrooms aren't the best. And I was like, 
I have to shit right now and this is gonna be bad. And so <laughs> I, went, I went to take a shit and when I took a shit, there was so much blood, so much blood. And I was like, now I think I need to see a doctor. But then I was like, no, 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 I don't need to see a doctor. Then I was okay, but it was, it was not fun. Like in general, I mean, it's essential. <laughs> I think there's like a whole other world to be unlocked <laughs> and waiting for people who haven't tried butt stuff. Oh, well, I'm pretty into it. <laughs> I don't particularly like to do a lot of butt stuff like where I am doing stuff with the butt, but I don't mind if someone else does stuff to my butt. Not on me. I don't like it on me. But like, I'm fine if some of my partner likes it on them, not on me. <laughs> I used to be very, very opposed um, I used to just think it was really gross, and I think it's when you meet the right person, you know, that doesn't make you feel gross about it, then maybe your mind will change, my mind did. I'm not a huge fan of butt stuff, you know? I don't know, I mean, as far as for me, like, t to me, and eh, no, nah, I'm not, I'm not down with that. Then again, I've never tried, and I don't wanna, you know, knock something I haven't tried, but I'm, I don't think I'm into that. Then again, I got a bunch of friends who are just all about that. And um, yeah, so I don't know. I don't think it's for me. Um, it's very kinky. I'd be open to it, but not like as like with anyone. I would have to do that with someone more like personal or like maybe if we've been together after like a couple years. That's like the holy grail of fucking sex for dudes. Like obviously a tight vagina is great. So like imagine an ass and of course it's, you know, a great feeling once you're open to the idea, but uh, I don't think you should, if you're in, if you're single, I don't think you should be doing that with everyone. Like you can't give them, no. Yeah, they can stick to the other thing. My ex-boyfriend wanted to do anal and I'll, and we try and it was so painful that I just told him to stop. And after that, I was like not into anything related to that. I'm not gonna make the choice. I'm gonna make her make the choice. Um, if she wants to do butt stuff, yeah, life is short. Let's try it out, you know? Um, I wouldn't like something going up my butt. So if you're asking in terms of butt stuff for me, I'm not comfortable. Things come out of my butt. They shouldn't go in. I mean, life's short. If it makes you happy, do it. But I think there's, um, I don't know, there's part of it's like, that's not sexy. The prep work isn't sexy. I don't know if people know about the prep work. I recently found out about the prep work. But like butt plugs and like anal, I don't know, if it tickles your fancy, then fucking do it. Yeah.